Hi, I'm Tom Kerr. I'm one of the senior staff instructors with Avixa, and we're going to do some audiovisual math. You may have seen an equation like this on social media. It's, can you solve this? Well, thankfully, there's help for this. It's called our order of operations. One of the ways to remember this, and it's called PEMDAS, and there's a number of mnemonics to uh, kind of keep this in order for you, one of which is, please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. And it tells us that what we need to do first is everything within the parentheses. So we're going to complete everything that's within the parentheses before we move on. Next, we're going to do any exponents or logs, like that 7 square that we saw a moment ago. The square there would be the exponent. Or we may have some logarithmic functions in the equation. After that comes multiplication and division. And multiplication and division carry equal, equal weight with one another, and we will just simply do those left to right. Lastly, we're going to do any addition and subtraction. And like multiplication and division, those two carry equal weight with one another, and we will do those left to right. So now I'm going to take my equation, and I'm going to follow the order of operations. The reason we do this is so that we have a consistent result every time. So I need to complete what, what is within the parentheses. And you can see there's multiple operations here. There's a plus, there's multiply, there's subtraction. So addition, multiplication, subtraction, which one do I do first? I do the multiplication following PEMDAS. So I'm going to do that 7 times 7, and that's going to be 49. So within the parentheses here, 7 plus 49 minus 7. And I'm going to put the rest of it out here, and we'll just do this step by step. I'm still within the parentheses, and this is just multiplication and subtraction, so I'm going to do these left to right. 7 plus 49 is going to be 56 minus 7, still operating within the parentheses, divided by 7. So still within the parentheses here, 56 minus 7 gives me 49, so 7 squared plus 49 divided by 7. I still have multiple operations. Which one do I do? I'm going to do the square. So 7 times 7, 7 squared, is going to be 49, plus 49 divided by 7. Still multiple operations, but I have addition and I have division. Which of these do I do first? I do the division before I do the addition. So 49 divided by 7 is going to be 7. So now we are at 49 plus 7. The only thing left is addition, and that is going to equal 56. And that's how we do all of these multiple operations following our order of operations PEMDAS. The other thing, when you do equations, not in this example, but if you have any rounding, the rule there is to leave any rounding until the absolute final result so that you don't end up with any rounding errors. So there's two things there. Follow PEMDAS and leave any rounding until the very end. Thanks for watching our videos. If you have any other questions or comments, please feel free to email us at avprofs at avixa.org.